Welcome to the project Dynamic SME. In this presentation, Paula Dynamica will illustrate the knowledge management tool Lessons Learned to the entrepreneur Victor. Hey Paula. Hey Victor, how are you doing? Hmm, Paula, I need your help. As you know, my enterprise has existed for many years. However, I have recognized that we systematically and repeatedly are making the same mistakes. These errors cost time and money. Don't worry, Victor. I know an easy to apply knowledge management tool that I have used for exactly the same problem in my enterprise. It doesn't take a lot of time and it holds excellent results. It is called Lessons Learned. It is a technique which documents knowledge a short time after it has been obtained. For example, of a project, a process or an activity. The people involved can compare the results of what was expected and what the result really was. In the end, success and failure can be determined and the information can be saved before it is forgotten. Wow, that sounds great, Paula. But I would like to know exactly what advantages this activity holds for me. Well, if you apply this tool at the end of each activity or project, you can, through a process of self-reflection carried out by those involved, determine the following which have been critical points regarding success and failure. What were the key aspects during the projects to keep in mind when conducting, for example, a project in the future? What went right and what went wrong? And for which processes do you need corrections? For each of the successes as well as the failures, you have to specify path to follow and the focus, so you are able to determine the right action if you encounter similar situations. These actions will in the end translate into a reduction of time, an improved efficiency of use of resources and finally thus reduction of costs of future projects. These measures will therefore represent an all-over improvement for your operations. If you furthermore give your employees the chance to share their opinions with you on certain processes, you are able to receive additional valuable information. This information may help during the planification and preparation for new projects. Hmm, very impressive, Paula. However, how can I implement this tool in my enterprise? Before the activity starts, you should know the final product. The knowledge management tool Lessons Learned is in the end a document which lists the results of a process in detail so the valuable information cannot be lost. To give an example, in my enterprise we created a document where everything was precisely detailed of what had been accomplished. In addition to answering the most important questions like what went well, what went wrong and what was learned, we tried to create context to the already existing lessons learned so that we could identify similar situations. The activity consists of three steps that are easy to follow. First, there should be a meeting among all the team members that are involved in the activity. Once this has been accomplished, the lessons learned sessions can be realized at the end of each project. If you are able to do it, I recommend that you implement such a session at the termination point of each phase or after a critical trigger event. This will allow you to get a good feedback of what has been accomplished until a certain point of the process, so you can evaluate your activities. Furthermore, the risks that important points are forgotten is reduced. In the next step, you should assign an instructor. The experience showed me that the project leader tend to dominate the meeting. I suggest that you appoint another team member. You should communicate with the instructor that his role is to help the team and encourage the participation of all people involved. It is furthermore essential that all team members involved understand that lessons learned is not only an evaluation but a consistent process of learning. All team members should reflect and discuss what happened. Finally, then they should complete the form, asking the following questions. What was supposed to happen? What really happened? What were the differences? What has been learned? 
Thank you for your detailed description, Paula. Do you have any tips or key aspects according to your experience that I should keep in mind when I implement such a lessons learned tool in my enterprise? Victor, before you start, it is important to keep in mind to present the agenda for the day and that you remind your team of the successes and failures that have occurred until now. Invite all people involved in an activity or project to a discussion. It is essential that all team members are participating with an open mind and that nobody is blamed for their actions. Lastly, Victor, it will be interesting for you to know that the knowledge tool Lessons Learned is especially useful in the recuperation phase after crisis. Thank you very much for your help, Paula. You're welcome, Victor. And if you need more information, I have some interesting links here for you. Or you may also access the information on the homepage of Dynamic SME, which also helped me to implement the knowledge management tool.